Hi, my name is Karen Orozco. I am the Outpatient Imaging Operations Manager. Um, I've been at Midland Memorial Hospital for 32 years. Um, I went to Midland College and I got into the x-ray program there. Um, I got my associate's degree after the two years and then went directly to work for Midland Memorial Hospital. Um, did some x-ray and then got into the CAT scan department. Uh, became supervisor in CAT scan. Then I went back to school and I got my bachelor's degree at Midland College as well in their Bachelor's of Applied Technology program. And recently I went back to school again to get my master's at UTPB. Uh, well, being in Maryland, um, I had some family that was down here in Midland. They were in the oil industry and one of my cousins kept asking me to come down and visit and said, we got a great college that's a local community college. So I thought, why not? So I came down here to Midland and that's how I got involved in Midland College. So outpatients, when you're dealing with just outpatients, they're normally the ones that are doing elective procedures who could come in with a doctor's script to have things performed. Um, as opposed to when you're working in the hospital and you have inpatients, they're the ones that are in the hospital, in hospital beds, coming down in, on stretchers and wheelchairs. Um, not to say that outpatient world is all walkie-talkie patients because some come in on in wheelchairs. I said we've also got the ones that are being transferred to us from um, say the rehab centers and they bring them into us with patient care people with them. Advice I would give to a high school student looking to get to radiology, uh, really study up on your sciences. Math is another good area to be kind of strong in but science is something very good. Um, one of the <laughs> I kind of laugh thinking about it and one of the things that I really took away from working in the yearbook part was layout and design and uh, that doesn't quite sound like it would match with x-ray but sometimes the way we have to present all our images and put them together it's a layout and design formula that you can use and you want to use your space to the best of its ability. There's lots of opportunities. Uh, I think think clearly as to whether you want to be in nursing, respiratory, or x-ray. Um, doesn't mean that you can't learn one and then go into another. We've had multiple people do that, but it's, it's actually an exciting place to be. There's always technologies changing and, you know, in x-ray we get to work with million dollar pieces of equipment, so it's, it's really neat to see how technology is evolving and all of the advancements that we've had.